everyone, and welcome to Shopping with Sonia. I'm your host, Sonia. So you obviously clicked on this video because we went to Five Below. Five Below is like a small department store. It has home decor, electronics, um, some and other things in between. So, um, ugh, I'm, I'm stumbling a lot. <laughs> and if you like what you see, please like the video, comment, share, subscribe to S Family Studios, all that jazz, and I hope you enjoy. Without further ado, let's go. Here we have summer playtime, shuffleboard, uh, inflatable limbo, ladder ball, which is basically horseshoes, battle buckets, kind of the same thing, giant four in a row, uh, bocce balls, giant inflatable soccer ball, outdoor horseshoes, croquette, croquette, croquet. <laughs> And I think under here is giant horseshoes again. Just a different version. Cam slam. Basically, it says yard pong. Potato sack races. Washer toss. I actually have one of those. And it works fine. Inflatable battle game. Limbo again. Different versions and different colors. And there's checkers and chess, bottle slam, beanbag toss, light up ring toss game, LED beanbag toss. Here are festival blankets. There's like a funky looking one, a peace one, and a Turkish throw. Little shovels, frisbees, giant balls, catching game. Little parachute, disco balls, ducks. Here's a kite. Trying to pull out. I think they set, claimed it as yard decor. And here are our cloth hammocks. Different colors, and they had one kind of hanging there, just to show. Uh, water bomb blaster. And he, I think these were more. It says pump up the fun. I think it was more water balloons. Wacky eyes that you wear on your finger. Minecraft and Star Wars sunglasses. Tetherball set. Here's like an end cap of art supplies. Succulents. Mosaic cactus that you can make yourself. A lot of DIY art projects. Probably because summer is around the corner. Frog stone, mushroom stone, snail. I think this was a dog and frog. Maybe they're both dogs. Here are some goggles. And little tiny easels. Cherry magnet. Rainbow birdhouse. Flower birdhouse. DIY, DIY necklace and bracelet set. Bunch of summer cups. Head in the clouds, free hugs with a shark. Palm tree and spiral drink or cups. And this says it's a beach cup holder. Never seen that. Some hula hoops and some pom poms and jump rope pom poms. Beach umbrella anchor and there's umbrellas next to that. Dollar twenty five noodles, pool noodles. And here are some decorative like deck things. There's a picnic basket and there's a picnic blanket. It was actually a watermelon when you folded it out. Some tote bags. Thomas Edison light bulbs. Lanterns. I don't know if that was just a holder or if it came with the glass. Here's some throw pillows. Patio pillows. Totes. Another picnic blanket and basket. Tennis rackets. Pickleball set. Another jump rope. And more badminton and tennis. Badminton set on on the on the bottom there. Kawaii nesting dolls, kind of like the Russian dolls. Wooden critter kit, dessert kit, burgers. Monster tail rainbow loom bracelets, tie dye kits. Clay cracking. And a fabulous surprise box. Here are some summer dresses. They're usually junior sizes, but I can fit into them. 
Here's a whole wall of different floaties. We have tacos, just beds of watermelon, cherry, pineapple. There's some cups. And beach towels. I like the cherry one. There's like a flamingo bird. A zebra up there and a gaming paddle. Hot dog. I think a slice of a grapefruit. Mixtape. Here's some Scrabble. They're calling it Jumbo Word Cross. More checkers and chess. Here's more tote bags and summer dresses. Different tote bags and hats underneath. And some bralettes and sports bras. Here's like a Starry Night shirt. Pretty cool. And underneath that is like tank tops and yoga shorts and normal shorts. Unicorn shirt. Here's a Stitch. Uh, Odie and Garfield. Outdoors adventure. And here are yoga pants, tie-dye ones, gray and black. Looney Tune shirt. Kind of crazy looking. Wakinda, Wakanda. I know it's Black Panther, but that's about it. A couple Star Wars. Give a hoot, don't pollute. Star Wars again with Yoda. Stormtrooper. Dungeons and Dragons. Endless quests. Mandalorian again. Another Mandalorian. And here's their wall of shirts. Live, laugh, love, grow, dream, believe. Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Never too old for fairy tales. Do what makes you happy. There's a Mr. Sparkle there with Homer Simpson. Stitch shirt. Got a moon sun one combo. Pray more, worry less. Here comes the sun. Live for the weekend. Take it easy. Be nice. Groovy. There's a cool wolf shirt right there. Frog got some mushrooms. Easily distracted by plants. Too fresh to care. National Sarcastic Society. If my mouth doesn't say it, my face definitely will. Apparently I have an attitude. I'm not for everyone. A bear that says don't like me. Okay. Here's our wall of socks. Here are our character ones. Spongebob Stitch, Star Wars, Marvel ones. Got some peanuts there and Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Betty Boop. Care Bears. And some just plain old ones. Pretty good socks. Here's some kitty ones. I believe they are a five pack. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Here's another side of the shirts. Hawaiian with Betty Boop. School of Rock with Jack Black. I'm not sure about that. A tribe called something. Jurassic Park, Jimi Hendrix. If I don't have some cake soon. It's from the office. I was trying to show the other half, but I was having difficulties. I'm sure people know the meme. Dungeon and Dragons again. A weird Marvel one. E.T. And a frog on some mushrooms. I think that was on the wall. Garfield there. Some Disney characters. Disney villains. Shorts, Malibu, another Malibu shirt, Bratz and Spongebob, some brown shorts under there, some puffy bags, and here are some of their headbands they had. And headscarves. Here's some character watches, Pokemon, Encanto, Super Mario, Dollhouse, LOL, Disney Princess, and Spider-Man, and Sonic and Star Wars. A couple more backpacks and a purse, zebra print, and some wallets, coin purses, pink and green Funkadelic ones, a couple more wallets. 
and a fanny pack. Just plain black. Here are a couple of their plush uh, pajama pants. Bear ones were my favorite. Koala. Cheetah print. Black and white hearts. And some leggings. Here are some of their shoes. Mostly sneakers and slip-ons. Pretty decent, especially for summer. And here are some skorts and dresses. And two tops, I believe they were. Throw pillows. Here are some fuzzy socks. Slipper socks. Sorry for the jumpage there. And here are some of their summer shoes. Got clogs, slippers, sandals. Flip-flops also. There's butterflies and daisies. Pretty cool. There's some tote bags there on the side. And here are like their cushionaire esque looking ones. They're squishy garden shoes. And some clogs next to there that are kind of like Crocs. Here are some toothbrushes. Got Flippy, Hot Wheels, and Barbie. And there's floss sticks and cup set. Or it comes with a cup with the toothbrush. And there's like a travel case with it. Pretty cool for kids. And there's a JoJo one there. Here's a couple cups. Kind of like ice cream ones. They heard Hershey. Here's like a wall of health and beauty. These are like bath bombs, uh, scrubbers, things for your face, gel socks, uh, eyebrow trimmers, massagers, blindfold, eye mask, nail polish. some bath scrubs and I think that's an electric face smoother. A lot of sunglasses to choose from. Decent too. And they also have some pick-me-ups. If you don't want to go to the store you can just pick up a five dollar bottle of shampoo. Q-tips. There's some mask there. Lotion. Tooth toothbrushes and toothpaste. Advil. Some ibuprofen. All that good stuff. Here's more loofah and brushes. Eco Tools, which is a name brand. More loofahs, exfoliation brushes, some hand gloves to keep them so your hands soft. They even had a travel section. If you're staying at a hotel, just grab something real quick or if you're gonna go travel. They're cheaper than normal stores like Walmart or grocery stores. Here are some hair brushes, mirrors, scrunchies, other hair accessories. There's a few pocket mirrors, well, probably not pocket mirrors, but small ones that you can hold. And here are makeup and jewelry organizers. There's cups and like little shelf desk shelves, perfume, some mirrors, uh, cases and bags for makeup. And they do have makeup brushes also. There's a butterfly and cat mirror, heart mirror. I was just doing a wide shot because they had so much. They have makeup palettes, eyeshadow. Um, oh, well, eyeshadow was that. Nail polish, mascara, blushes, face toners, and face masks. They had LA color. Sometimes they have e.l.f. I've seen it there. And they also had fake nails and nail glue to put on there also. Eyelashes, more palettes. They have some travel pillows here and a bunch of throw pillows, blankets. Just like a whole wall of them, decorative pillows and more blankets. And here are like some soup bowls, containers, coffee mugs. Pretty cool, there's a kitty one, Mandalorian one. You are my soul, you are my moon, and my stars. Enjoy the journey, not without my coffee. And there's some ramen bowls that come with the chopsticks and more food containers. We have a floating wall shelf, a couple other ones, some baskets for storage. Corner shelf here. 
And these are rugs. Different shapes, color sizes. <laughs> And if you have a cat or dog fellow, there's a whole ball of stuff for them. Some pet beds, chew toys, leashes, things like that. Here's some decorative room stuff. There's a bed canopy, blow-up furniture, um, collapsible baskets, hampers. Here's like a six cube shelf right here. There's like different hangers, over the wall or door hangers. There's just a random uh, wooden Jenga, giant wooden Jenga. Giant inflatable dartboard. Here's more home decor, they have lava lamps, bundle of frames. This was a collapsible um, ottoman, it was kind of, it was heavy and hard to take out. Another three-tier shelf. Here's comforters, sheet sets, pillowcases, and pillows. More shelving and storage unit. Here is some weightlifting things and massagers. Massage cushion for a chair. A few thing technical things. Lights, keyboards. Not really sure what these were. They had like special edition Attack on Titan ep episodes. Uh, one piece manga here. Up top I think were dragons from an anime that I'm not aware of. They have a whole wall of headphones. And I like their Hershey's and Reese's ones right here. And they do last. I bought one for my husband one time. And they stretch really good. Here are more for like kids. They have squishimals. Unicorn ones and there's a kitty cat one. Different colored ones. Here are switch cases. We have Naruto, uh, Black Panther, Avengers, and a black Naruto one. And cases for iPhones. Looks like a 12, 13, 14. And there's one for iPhone 11 I believe. Just like this whole big wall. If you like squishmallows, they always have a good abundance and they're usually cheaper than other places. And they had two big crates full of them here. And here's more of their weightlifting section. They have yoga mats, uh, dumbbells. They have a lot to see. <laughs> here's some Play-Doh playing kits. Slimes, slinkies. Oh, bunches of goodies for kids. And these were basically um, science experiments, make your own bracelets and things like that. I think this one was like a nail kit, screen print, wall art, marble pour. And here's more of their art stuff. They have paint brushes, painting canvases, easels. Here is an aisle just full of board games. We have Clue, there's a Spongebob game, Pictionary, Guess Who, there's a Clueless game, Trouble, Battleship, Headbands there, Battle Fleet, whatever that is, Connect Four, Wheel of Fortune, there's a small logo game, they have like a spin, well who is it, that's kind of funny, it's like a knockoff of Guess Who. Fishing game. They had one that's like hungry, hungry, uh, hungry turtles right there, like hungry, hungry hippos. Here's an end cap of different coloring books and activity books. Got peanuts, SpongeBob minions, Rugrats, and a whole bunch of art supplies and e uh, can't remember what that is. Color pencils, pens, sketch pads, markers. Whole lots of paints. Here's some magnets. Love the scorpion one that says fight. Kind of got cut off there. And here's some pottery supplies if you don't want to break the bank and get some cool stuff. 
And they have like a small little wall of balloons that you can get from them. Here's a little bit of their figurines in Yasha BT21, which I think is, um, what is that band called? There's Haiku, Naruto, Tokyo Avengers, Poppy, BTS, Curvy, <laughs> Demon Slayer, they're like sleeping. Uh, My Melody Karomi, which is kind of like a spin-off, more Demon Slayer of Hello Kitty. These were Five Below exclusive man mangas, and there's a jigsaw up there of Demon Slayer. Cells at work. Four beasts. There's a couple Attack on Titan. Yo Kaiden, I think that was. Hunter Hunter. A couple pillows, Attack on Titan. There's more puzzles down there. There's Haiku and some other ones. Have like ninja stuffies. Welcome back everyone. So I have kind of a big haul. So I'm not going to talk too much. As you guys see, they have a lot of things and every store is probably different. So just go check one out. And some of their stuff's a little pricey probably because it's inflation. So more stuff is like $2 to $5. And then they have a $10 section and a $15 section. But you never know what you're going to find there. It's pretty cool. Without further ado, I'm going to go through it. But first, I went to Hot Topic. I didn't get much, but I wanted to do these blind bags. One is a Demon Slayer which is becoming one of my favorite um, mangas and animes. And I have this The World of Studio Ghibli one. So, I'm just gonna open it. Oh, that opened really easy. How come they're never that easy? Let's see what I get. Oh my god, it's Cat Bus! <laughs> I love Cat Bus. No, I thought they were gonna be hard, but it's like gummy texture. Oh yeah, that's, that's really easy. Alright, so that's my Studio Ghibli one. So let's check. Let's hopefully this one will be as hard. Oh, I got scissors. I got scissors. Alright. Oh, I already saw who it was. But I like it. <laughs> oh, this is a magnet! I thought this was a clip! Oh well. That's kinda cool though. Got Tanjiro! He's a big old magnet. My favorite is, uh, I'm probably gonna say it wrong. It's Yu Yu Gaiyu. It says Gaiyu. I think it's very good. He's my favorite. But I like Tanjiro also. All right. Without further ado, let's just get through this big five below haul. And I know they have a lot of fashion things, and they're mostly juniors. But I've gotten some good shirts there. This one is kind of like a black crop top that ties, kind of like um, waffle fabric. And I saw this online and I had to get it. It's a creepy kawaii, kawaii coloring book. It has like mythical things and like spooky things. Kinda, they don't really show the book in this, but it's fun. I, it's cool. <laughs> Nothing too big, but uh, moisture gloves since between uh, winter and spring, my hands get really dry, so I'm just, I've been out wanting a pair of these. And I got a Turkish throw. I don't know why it has like string on it, but whatever. Oh, I think it just ties it so it's like a carry. Hi. But yeah, I got this just to like because I like laying in the sun, reading all this stuff, or laying in the shade. And I used to have a tanning mat, but it's kind of getting worn out, so this is the replacement. And I got these cool Kirby socks. And the other pair is Mr. Ninja Wallaby. Oh, it just says bandana waddle <laughs> And I forgot about this. This was a we went to FYA too and I got uh, a few Godzilla things, including this shirt. It says King of the Monsters on the front, on the back, with this huge scene. And my husband uh, has this boxing um thing. It's not like like a kickboxer one. It's one of them like balloon looking ones that you put in uh on a pole and fill the base with water or sand and my son has been playing with the boxing gloves so I got these small ones that would fit him better. I, it says ages 8 and up so 
I didn't really, I just saw them on a shelf. They weren't, I don't think they were in the right spot, but I'm like, I need to get these because they'll fit him better. Because the big ones look ridiculous on him, so I was like, then they can box together. <laughs> and something for me uh, is a, ex uh, well, it says dry body brush, but it's like exfoliates your skin. And Eco Tools is actually a name brand, so it's pretty good. And I do uh, homeschool my child. He is going to school next year, but I got another book because we've been doing it since he's about three years old. It's just three to five preschool scholars. It's like the third book I've used just to get him ready for school. Then I just bought two loofahs for my son, and I was debating on putting this on here, but I will. It's for my niece. My niece that starts with Z. I won't say her name just in case my sister don't want her name. But if you're watching Z, this is for you. It is a manga drawing set. It has different markers and they're double tipped. Like it's a soft brush tip, chisel tip. Yeah, they're double sided markers. And she's she has an anime coloring book and she blows my mind with how good she is. And she's drawing now and it looks amazing. So I thought I was like I had to get her this. More markers never hurt. And I forgot, I have one more blind bag, and this was from Five Below. It is Kirby. Here's some of the ones you can get. Let's see what we got in here. It's funny, because this one was at FYE and Hot Topic for like $8. And this one, I think, I believe was $5. Oh, yeah! It's the sword one. And I believe that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this long haul, had fun, and see what my interests are. But uh, like I said, if you liked it, please like it and subscribe. See you next time on Shopping with Sonya.